into hip hop. Intensity is what makes her shine as an artist. She's crazy, she can play anything. She's one of the people that's taking it to the next level. Let's go! I had to discover hip hop on my own. I fell in love with hip hop through Biggie. I walked to the, you know, to the hit factory and I played for Cliff. That's how I met Alicia Keys. I got on Falling. I met Joe, my name's Joe. Did one with him. Eventually I met Michael Jackson. Eventually I, I came up with my own style. It's not an easy first. It's not like you wake up one day and you're, whoa, I'm the hip hop violin. It's, it ain't like that. Gee, I grew up in Israel. My mom played the piano and the guitar. My dad played the violin. My mom gave me the violin when I was five. They love music. I grew up on classical music. She played for the uh, Israel Army String Quartet. Military service, it's mandatory, no choice. I had my little Uzi. I was doing the basic training with other soldiers. You know, I was a soldier like everybody else. I always knew that classical music was not for me. I, I came to United States because yeah. I wanted to study jazz. New York is, you know, it's the big alpha. I, Jay, I, write... I didn't even know how difficult it was about to be. I got to work with a lot of jazz musicians. If you can find a club that I didn't play at in New York, I'm gonna pay you something. That's how I got my chops. I, you know, I believe in order to, to become better, you need to practice your craft. They suggested that I play Star Spangled Banner. The president of Universal Records, uh, Mr. Doug Morris, was, he was on his way out at the beginning of the show and he couldn't leave the room because it was the national anthem. He heard me playing. I just got signed like that one night. is really new to me. My project, The Hip Hop Violinist, exists because the hip hop community wanted it. My album is self-titled. It's called Miri ben Ari, The Hip Hop Violinist, um, on Universal Record. It's almost shocking when I'm thinking about it, you know, having so many platinum artists on, on a new artist album. Kanye West is one artist that I had I would say the most experienced working with. It was such a privilege to really spend time in the studio with him. He's so on top of his, his, his craft. Mary's about to bless my album with some strings. I'm honored to be able to work with her before she get too big for me. Dougie Fresh, Mini Mafia, Fury, Fabulous. Working with Twister was a great experience. The way he rhymes like on stage, his execution is it's like perfect. My, um, Fat Man Scoop, Little Vicious, Anthony Hamilton. She's Miri ben Ari, the hip hop violinist compared to nobody else. A little Mole, Little Flip, E-40, Scarface. I think Mary's dope. Ghostface, playing for Babyface, and he was actually checking me out and listening to how I play. Right now I got a 
hip-hop violinist in the house tonight. Working with Jiga, you get to see like the hard work, you get to understand that that you know, being an artist is not just being able to, to spit on the mic, it's like being able to produce a show, to have a concept, to, um, to pull everything together, to, to be responsible. When, when we did Summer Jam, Jiga came, he came to my rehearsal and he just, he just sat down and listened to him, you know, after living with his DJ, because he wanted to make sure that when I get on stage, I'm good. The BMI Award was the first time that I actually received an award for my work as the hip-hop violinist. My award was for Overnight Celebrity. I actually performed that night. It was a great moment for me. This is crazy because my record is not even out and I'm already receiving an award. When you're thinking about the music world of today, you box everything, uh, you categorize everything. Everything needs to fit. When you're looking at a violin, it's actually an acoustic box. I just like thinking outside the box. I'm always, always thinking ahead. And of course I got ideas for my next album. You just have to um, wait and see.